Greetings out there in YouTube land. Well, I, s I wonder, do you see your mansion in front of you out there? Well, that's an interesting thing, because a lot of people think they're going to get some fancy mansion when they go up to heaven with the Lord. But that's not exactly what he meant when he talked about it here in John 14. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I would go to the pair a place for you. In his Father's house there are many mansions. What does the word mansions mean? This is our terminology, modern terminology. Just like our modern terminology uses the word leasing as a time-sensitive rental agreement. But in the Bible days, leasing meant lying, telling lies. That's what it means to God. So what did he mean by mansions in John 14 there? Well, that's easy. Mansions translates from a word that meant dwelling places built around the exterior wall of the temple. That's right. Think of an apartment building where you see all the little apartments. Yep. Not no fancy mega 8 million room mansion or anything. Yep, a lot of people are thinking they're going to get when they get to heaven. But a small, simple place to hang and chill and relax with the Lord. There are many, many interesting things about the meanings of words and all that that have changed over the years, right? But the thing is, nowhere does the Bible refer to heaven as my father's house. See, that's most interesting. And you've got his temple coming down here. So in this father's house, which is coming down, are many mansions, which is rooms. A little reading goes a long way. Think about it and crack open your Bible and have a good read. Think about what it says. Pay attention to the wording. And if you don't understand for sure, check it out. God bless and have a great day. Bye-bye.